So basically, but I am for Trump. A lot of people are saying that George Clooney, like basically him not endorsing, refusing to endorse Biden, kind of got this whole thing started because they had some kind of a. George Clooney, Power, what, what good fucking, like they always say, what good fucking movie, what the fuck was, what good movie is George Clooney acting in? Ocean's Eleven? Uh, what is that, the heist? Yeah. With the casino? No, I just like George Clooney. I just like that. Uh, one so do you think he's actually behind, behind this stuff, Clooney? though? Who? Like, Obama? if George Clooney is like, hey, I'm not going to endorse Biden. It's all the Clintons, dog. So you think the Clintons are behind George Clooney or George Here's Clooney my behind thing. the Clintons? Here's my thing. If you're a first lady, how the fuck do you think, like, you already have access to all this crazy shit. What gives you the right to think you can try to go be president when you basically were One fucking president. the president? You yeah, ba- for eight years. I don't know if she was. Maybe that's why she's trying to get back in it, because, you know, Monica Lewinsky. I don't know. I'm starting to, like, I'm starting to get, like, we can go deep with this shit real quick. I'm starting to believe that, like, yeah, it's a puppet show. Just choose the lesser of the evils. But at the same time, what about shape shifting and fucking every time they try to take a sip of water, they don't even really drink nothing. Shit gets weird, dog. It gets real weird. Hmm. It's just, it's a... Uh, I never thought of it like that. Yeah, it's like, fuck it, you know. You can't, you can't just tell everybody this shit because then they'll just fucking lock your ass up and psych ward you. Know? Oh, he's just crazy. So who's your pre- like who's the perfect presidential candidate? Is it Trump? Is it somebody else? Since I've been alive? I'm saying like who is alive right now who would be the best presidential candidate to I'll run? tell you the one ever since I've been alive. Who? Trump. So you think he's the best presidential President candidate out of Trump. every American right now? Uh every American? I don't know. I ain't really that deep into politics. I mean, because any American could be president, obviously, because Trump just came out of nowhere and was like, I'm going to be president, and everybody thought it was a joke. And he ended up winning. So that just goes to show, that's the epitome of the American dream, I think. A guy who was literally a TV show, and that's happened with Reagan, but like, well, Reagan was about, somewhat it's presidential. About, it's all about Trump, influence. Trump. I just believe it's all about influence. Trump literally just came in there like, it was his TV show. You got to respect that. And he was like, this is how I'm going to be president. Just doing what I've already been doing. Basically, he's saying I should have been president. Yeah, but what he was doing with the apparent, well, who knows if it's real, but what he was doing with the national debt. What was he doing? Like the stock market, even after COVID, like stock market, they got it back booming. Like, God dang, God. Is that Obama, though? I don't believe so. I feel like Obama, oh, shit. Hmm. Obama's a pretty good president. How maybe. tall is Obama? I don't know, like six foot something, I guess. I don't know. What was the other? You think he's a puppet? He's a shapeshifter? No, I have my own crazy conspiracy, but I'm not going to talk about that. Oh, come on. Why? I want to know. I want to freaking know. Nah, because you know how conspiracies go, man. It's going to be what actually happened. No, nah, it's, it's kind of far-fetched, and I don't have anything to back it up. Oh, okay. I believe, okay, I was just saying, I believe that Obama was really like a CIA transplant from a foreign country. That's the best way I can phrase it without getting too detailed. So you, that's why he's not considered American? Well, that, and then uh, what was the lady, the white lady from Hawaii that like died in the plane crash? Like around the whole birth certificate ordeal? I don't know, they gave the birth certificate, I thought. I looked that up on Google a couple weeks ago. No, I ain't never. Man, they can forge all that shit, dude. I'm not saying they can't, but it's kind of a lot of trouble to go through it. But yeah. who's he providing it to if he's already the president? What, the Supreme That's what I'm Court? Saying. So he was already president, and then he provided the birth certificate. So does that say more about him, or does that say more about people just not wanting to believe him because he's Obama? No, it has to do with the government already being corrupt as fuck. They don't care about us. They don't care about the low class. They try to destroy the middle class. But who was the birth certificate for? Uh, I guess some journalists just found dirt on him. I don't know. But it was his real birth certificate saying he was American after everybody told him to provide his birth certificate because they didn't believe he was American. I've never seen it. 
I literally looked it up. I seen it. I ain't seen what the real color thing. Was it? It was like yellow. It was on a sheet of paper. I don't know. Well, our uh, Hawaiian. It said his daddy was Kenyan. Yellow. His mama was American. Um, I got something about that about his dad. But it don't matter if he was born in America. That's how that works, bro. 